Hey everybody, I'm Adam. And I'm Jay. Welcome to Movie Preview Review, where we review movies based on only watching their previews. And today we're going to react, review, and riff off of the new trailer for Cloak and Dagger, the Marvel television show? Mm -hmm. television, television show, coming to Freeform this June. Okay. Because apparently D uh, Marvel's got so many shows coming out, they just can't contain them on any Man, one network. So many networks. Send them all out! I'm... Send the birds! <laughs> we must get the message to everyone! <laughs> Marvel! Go! I don't know much about Cloak and Dagger. They show up in some Spider-Man comics here and there. Yeah, they're actually big players in uh, uh, Civil War. Are they? The first one? It's how Cap gets around. Oh. It's Cloak. Cool. Yeah, alright. Let's check it out. First, we look at the past. New Orleans is a roller coaster of destruction and rebirth. Fire, famine, disease, war. It always came down to two people. The divine pairing. Voodoo, my blood is living. Jimmy got soul of mimic. I feel like I have to be perfect. Like I have to do everything right. I go the other way. I run away from everything. I've had a lot of things taken from me. And everything I have, I've had to steal. There's something about fear that pushes me. That was my whole life. Whenever anything goes wrong, I hightail it out of town. I think we need to talk. When we touch, shake those bones. Assess our limits. It's the same as it was for all the others. One will live, and one will die. The universe keeps pushing us together. The universe keeps pulling us apart. I'm yours, I'm yours. Wow. Okay. Okay. I am intrigued. And it's freeform, so it has to be a high school drama. Well, yes. That's how Freeform does it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So, do you know anything else about these characters? Not particularly. Oh, okay. I, like, they're... <clears throat> it's never a book I ever really read. Did they have their own book for a while? I think they... Yeah. Here and there. In and out. But they've always been kind of like outliers. Yeah. I'm most frequently uh, familiar with them as, like, supporting characters on, like... Some of the Marvel animated shows of late, like they show up a lot of times in Spider-Man animated uh, cartoons in the past few years, and things of that nature. Uh, but this seems interesting, you know, not with the the it, I wouldn't say love, but some type of cosmic connection where they need to be around each other, but at the same time they hurt. They're like the yin and, and the yin and the yang. Ah. I'm imagining. That's that kind of makes that more sense because his powers are like black and his powers are white. And My like, question <laughs> is, how does where does the Freeform universe fit into the rest of all of this stuff? In that, is it a part of it? Is this is this connected with like Agents of Shield? Is this like in that realm? Is this it, which is technically part of the movie universe? Like, is all is this going to be a break from the Marvel canon? I they haven't done it yet. Yes, they have. What do you mean? Uh, Runaways on Hulu. Oh, you're right. Mm -hmm. But no, but run, does Runaways not? I mean, as far as we know, as I I believe, guys, back me up on this one. Hulu, the Runaways on Hulu is just it's its own thing. I'm pretty sure this is probably just its own thing. I don't know if I like that. You want, the, you want them to be interconnected? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. I, I, if I'm being honest, I don't know if the, these characters are... I don't know if this can... We'll see how long this lasts. Yeah, which is... It well, looks cool. I'm it just looks, not totally optimistic. It's just, what's the story? Morning Glory. What's hmm. the word? Hummingbird. Oh. 
Because I mean, we got two teenagers, two teenagers with powers that are drawn together and some, somehow also kept apart. But what are they fighting against, or what is their cosmic destiny, or something like that? Um, See, now I'm gonna have to Wikipedia cloak and dagger because I'm wildly unprepared, and I'm sorry, internet. I'm sorry. Well, this is a true preview review because we are going purely yeah. off of the preview here. Indeed. The preview? Sure. The preview. The movie preview. Review. Uh, the movie pure preview and preview and preview. Review. Usually, uh, these high school drama type power shows have a you know a larger cast of characters uh, that at least have some powers or eventually will get powers. And it seems like at the moment it's just these the two of them, uh, and what are they up against is the question that will you know sustain the show or the show will wither and die. Would you have Would you have dark powers or light powers? And if what and, and if we if we were a superhero duo with, with light and dark powers, which one would be which? I mean, you'd be the light one. I don't know about that. Really? I don't know. You think you're the dark one? Yeah, I don't know, man. Huh. I don't know. I mean, I, I do hope... We're vir- we are virtuous in our own ways. We, yes, indeed we are. Uh, I don't I like teleporting. Okay. Uh, I don't know if it necessarily has to be teleporting. But just like, basically a light and dark type power, yeah. power sets? Mm-hmm. Hmm. I'm assuming that's what they were going for. Yeah, I mean, for the most part. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Um, I, that's a very interesting question. I, cause I always kind of view myself and this may be arrogant, but like a, the Superman type of like, you know, the rallying point of we can do it. Come on guys. Jay, let's shoot some videos. Here we go. Let's make stuff. Everybody let's do things. Hooray. It's not totally off base. That's usually how it goes. Uh, you're coming over, but I don't want it. You're doing it. <laughs> get, get over here. We're going to have some fun. <laughs> Yay. Yay! Uh, Bring extra shirts <laughs> to make it look like we wore different. We are doing these on different days. Um, but there, I mean, but there's also that cold, calculating side of me. Yeah, that I could very easily be like more of the uh, kind of like chaotic neutral. Okay. And you, you know, but you're so happy and joyful. Yeah, but I also have a lot. But I also have a lot of. I I I have a lot of struggles. You have a dark passenger. I have a dark passenger. I don't know if I have a dark passenger. Yeah. You definitely do. Yeah, definitely. I definitely do. And his name is Doug. (laughs) And uh, he is a very good card player. Well, let's leave it up to you guys. Yeah. If you've watched this far, internet, let us know. If you've watched this far. who do you he probably has... turned it off as soon as we were like, we don't know anything about these characters. <laughs> it's quite possible. Whoops! When you saw that Whoops lost look in our eye. Oh! Like, no. Neat! <laughs> That's a cool bike he's riding in that one scene. Cool, man. Who do you think would have what power set? And who's the good one and who's the not as good one? Yeah. Who's, who's the Superman who's the Batman? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think you're Batman and I'm Superman. Huh. Weirdly. I know you more have the body for Superman, and I more have the... I'm also from Kansas, so that That's helps. true, you are from Kansas. Hey, hey. Uh, all right. All right. Cloak and Dagger, everybody. Freeform, in all likelihood, is a channel you've rarely heard of. Yeah. But maybe. My wife likes Freeform. Oh, does she? Yes, Kimberly is big into Freeform. What does what show is her show on Freeform? Uh, she likes that vampire one, Shadowhunters or whatever. It's not good. It's not a good show. It's really not. I've never heard of that yeah. one. Yeah. But it's uh, but it's fun. Well, I mean, it used to be ABC Family. Yeah. So, because I'm that type of person who remembers the older names of all the channels. Yeah, remember D- uh, D- WGN? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I remember WGN. UPN? Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, UPN. Back when it was, uh, yeah, UPN and WB before they merged. Man, back when those companies, like, rebranded, my first thought was always, that's a terrible idea. They're never going to, we're never going to want to call it that. And then, like, three days later, it's like, oh, yeah, it's on it's on, uh, it's on Freeform. Oh, okay, neat. No big deal. Yep. Oh, the n- n- 90s? Sure. When yeah. cable channels were Nebulous. much more simplistic and... It was kind of the Old West. Yeah. This is our central thesis, and we're sticking to it. And Ted holds sway. Held sway. Hmm. All right. Well, <laughs> <laughs> cloak and dagger, everybody. 
Claw and dagger, everybody! Yeah, he teleports. She throws things. She better have a good arm. Man, that would be horrible if she got cosmic powers and have light daggers and was like a really bad thrower or just didn't have the coordinate. Ah. Or like, or seriously, or just one arm. It's light. I'm assuming you just extend your hand and it goes exactly where I you need hope, to. but if she actually has to get a little, you know, she may be only good with like her right light arm. Light doesn't, it's not affected by gravity. Ooh. All right. Same. I know science. Those light daggers seem to have a little bit of mass to them. Yeah. I mean, light also has a little bit of la la mass to them as well. Okay, we're getting off the point. Uh, like! Uh, subscribe! <laughs> let us know what we missed, because we probably missed a few yeah. things. Uh, and let us know if you're interested in this show at all. Yeah. Cool, guys. Thanks for watching. We appreciate it. You're awesome. Bye. Bye! World's flat. Prove me wrong! <laughs>